Hey, this is Matt from the Weekend Handyman. Uh, today I'm going to try to get some extra horsepower on my Explorer. I'll bypass the AC pump here. Uh, all you're going to need is a flathead screwdriver, 3 8 socket wrench, and uh, a shorter belt. For the Explorer, it's available. You just ask for a uh, non-AC pump belt. And actually, the uh, clutch went on the AC here, so it starts. It's Explorer. <laughs> Look at that. Fucking... Is it the AC pump, I think, just froze on me and toasted my belt? So, first thing here is you can see the directions are right here to change out the belt. It shows you which way to go. All we need to do is pull this back here off of the intake. Just a flat screwdriver. Just loosen that up. Pull that off. A little extra work room there. really don't care. Get down here, it says to lift counterclockwise. Nothing is ever simple. There it is, it's in there. Parkway, so the belt just comes off nice and easy like that. Attention, the belt in. Everything. I hope you don't die. You might die. So you can see what going on better. Hopefully this view is a bit better for you guys to see what belt on. I'm on the Explorer. Here's a new one. I'm going to get it down and around on the harmonic balancer. This is a pain in the ass, by the way. Excuse my language, Matt. There's more room to work on the truck. A little bit of a truck. That's funny. I don't believe that for one minute. Looks like this comes around here like this. And then come down here to this pump. Over. That is correct. Oh, it goes under the idler pulley. Goes under the idler. There. So the alternator. Blow you onto the power steering pump. Um, tension, make sure it's all good. Make sure everything is lined up. Line up and release the least tension. If you can see where that socket is, I'll show you. Right my own camera keeps dying, so this is my iPhone. Uh, what I was going to show you is down here the tensioner. Um, there's a square hole in it, as you can see on the diagram, right there. And the ratchet goes in there, and we just turn it counterclockwise and it pushes down and releases the tension on the belt. So, pretty easy. You can get down in there. See the old belt down in there. See the old belt. Pretty simple. And there's the AC bypass. The clutch is gone. I don't know why it was smoking. It spins freely. But, uh, odd. Maybe when it's spinning, it sees. I don't know. I'll well, we'll put the air intake back on now. Simple as shut on there. Sorry, yeah. Tighten it back down. And yes, that should yield us some extra horsepower. Not really. 
Sometimes people do do AC deletes on high power cars to gain more horsepower a little bit. Probably not getting too much sleep. So now we're just gonna start it up and make sure it works.